Hello, I'm Adam Cinema with Success in Fundraising, and we're here to talk about pastries and stuff, and oh, I guess it's St. Patrick's Day too, and that's pretty fantastic, you know, and everything, and yeah, you know, we're gonna do hey. the give- Yeah? Who are you? I'm Adam Cinema with Success in Fundraising. How can you be Adam Cinema from Success in Fundraising? Because I have the shirt that says shirts are good and the fancy hat, and I am Adam Cinema with Success in Fundraising because I said so. What? Yep, that's you need to get works. out of here. <laughs> what? <laughs> it's time for you to go. Okay. <laughs> so, sorry, Jennifer. <laughs> Too harsh. <laughs> so, something really interesting happened this last week, and thank you for Jennifer, who is Jennifer, as you must know, that. Uh, <clears throat> With our Facebook post for the giveaway, we uh, we actually got cloned. So this 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 group set up a Facebook profile, not another business page, but a profile named after us, sort of. And they started commenting on the comments on our giveaway post, saying you have to follow this other link for the giveaway. So they're guiding people away from us. And when I went and looked, it's called a clone. So we thought we'd intro with that, and. Uh, but it's a little bit frustrating. So you go find this clone out there. It's like success with only one S dash fundraising LLC. You can go find it and go go complain to Facebook about this page because they're copying us. Uh, we already did and everyone else who commented did because they're a little bit bothered too that this group, I don't even know what they're looking for, personal information, I guess. But it's a little obviously frustrating, but maybe a little bit of a compliment. It's like we've never been much of an entity. It's like, oh wait, criminals are trying to find us or utilizing us. Maybe that's uh, maybe that's a compliment as well. I don't know. Maybe a sideways compliment, but but uh, sort of weird. So we'll see what happens from now on. Hopefully, they don't keep harassing our people. Uh, but we're gonna we make sure to, that they're blocked and they can't comment anyway. But I don't know what else they could do. It's so weird. Maybe it is that easy to establish. It is easy to establish a profile. You go to that profile. And you see our whole history. They're just sharing our posts. They, they took them an hour to share like 35 posts and this giveaway. And they had like 4,000 of their friends already on the list too. It was amazing. So, mostly in the Middle East, I suppose. And so they're obviously not us. And so you wouldn't see, yeah, familiar people at least. So thank you for those who caught it. Uh, Lori Woman was the first one that told me about it. She was one that commented, and she's like, is this you? I said, no. Arr. And so uh, we did that. So we thought that we'd share that with you. Jennifer volunteered to be my clone. <laughs> so, uh, so that was great. She had to scoot, so that was uh, that worked, timing worked out perfectly. But uh, things are going really well. I was going to announce a winner, but uh, I've been incredibly busy. So I apologize. I'm going to announce the winner shortly, because after this I'll go... Pull the winner and uh, announce it to on the post and on the page. So I apologize for those who have entered. It is going to be just a little bit longer. And I might not get one up and running. Uh, it is our busy time of year. And it uh, turns out I get to drive, do some driving next week. So I'm not going to be in the office, not get to conspire on how to make videos. Probably show up at the end of the week and we'll just make one anyway. But uh, we'll let Jennifer do that kind of figuring. Jennifer will be, be running the office. We're excited about that. And... Uh, Another thing to remember is uh, do go to Butterbraid Fundraising Facebook page. Find the giveaway for the moped and pastries. So it's a, it's a moped worth roughly $2,500, and it's th roughly $3,500 worth of pastries you can get for a group, a local group. So 100% profit if you can sell these, uh, whatever you want to do with them. But you go out and sell them, you keep all of the money you get for it. We give you, not we, but Country Made gives you $3,500 worth of pastries. And so that, to me, is exciting. And I would love to see one of the groups in our territory win that, mostly because I want to get a ride on that moped. That's pretty much it. So, uh, no, it's not it. I want you guys to get that the money for your group as well. I think that's really cool. Uh, so the adventure with that might not, we might skip a week with the giveaway. We'll see. We might get a short one out before next week. Uh, before we go. Pretty excited. Deliveries are really ramping up. Uh, Nicole did a bunch of deliveries last week and we have 
basically starting on, we had a few this week, but starting on Monday, we got deliveries till Easter, and a week break, and then deliveries for a couple weeks after that. So they're all happening. Numbers are coming in good. Congratulations to all your groups out there. Everyone's getting out there and selling. Communities are supporting you, so that's exciting from our point of view. We just, we're just so encouraged when we see communities supporting these groups. And uh, just really, yeah, happy to be a part of that and to be able to connect and support. So I guess we'll leave it at that. Have a wonderful, oh, <laughs> my clone said, said it, but I should say it too. I said it just before I walked up. I was like, is it St. Patrick's Day? It's like, yes. So don't forget, to, don't forget to wear green. Not like me. And so, uh, but happy St. Patrick's Day. And hopefully that you enjoy that. Celebrate a little if you can. And have a wonderful week. We'll see you next time.